with another video. Hey friends, hey family. Mi gente, como estas? Bienvenidos. It's your girl Melissa Q back with another video. In today's video, we are going coming with our April favorites. It's already May. So let's start off with hair care. Yes. Let's talk talk about the thing that y'all already saw. Hmm, it's a favorite. If y'all haven't checked out the review, I'm not going to go into the details of this, but you can pick this up from Target. It's one of my favorite to date. It's one of my favorite, one of my favorite gels from the drugstore. Why? Because the devil is not in it. And y'all, if you don't know what the devil is, go look at the video. You'll see. But love this gel. And so this is the main choice. Crystal Orchid Biotin Infused Gel. That was a long name. But it is worth every penny. And it's a favorite of mine. And also, it's in my hair. Love it. Something that I haven't reviewed, but I've talked about and I'm halfway through and this is the Soul Tanicals Knot Sauce Coil Detangler. I get a lot. This is 32 ounces. They have started to sell the liters again. FYI y'all, but this is glycerin free. Y'all know I love, I actually have a glycerin free playlist. So if you guys want to check it out, I'll throw it up in the cards or put it down below. So make sure you check out the description box. But y'all, this has been a favorite. I also have that in my hair and I've been loving this. I should have talked about it more. I can do a full review if you guys want to know. There are a lot of not sauce, but y'all know Mystic Palo has not done it so it might needs to be done but i really do enjoy this product and um yeah it's glycerin free the devil is out of this and i say satan yes it's not in here so yeah we love this so i have a full review of this but it's back in the day if you want to see it um uh, it's kind of embarrassing but the curl junkie curl queen yeah I'm a Curl Junkie fan. It's one of my favorites. I love, I love a lot of their products. And so this is the, the Curl Queen Styling Hair Gel. If you have fine, thin hair, you're really going to like this because it's one of those like very thin syrupy and you're going to get a lot of volume in your hair. So I have been loving this. I've been using that quite a bit this month. This is mint almond oil and so it smells so good it smells like peppermint but i really do like this it's something that you could use for a scalp massage and i want to say it was $8.99 i got this from a sally's um from sally's beauty i did i think a sally's haul and if i can find the video i will link it but this is i really do and i really like this oil okay I'm going to come with my favorite oils. I think oils are like one of those things that people, you know, we cocktail it. Sometimes you don't have time and you want some really good products, but that one is a good one, y'all. This is the Red Can All Soft. Y'all, this is so good. It's protein infused and it's by Red Can. I love this so much. And I actually paired it with the Red Can Extreme Strength Builder Plus. This is a strength builder like it says so it's a protein conditioner i use these type of items when i go straight i will show y'all how my hair looks straight yes but but this is um i really do like this combo and i wanted to show you this is what i keep at the ready when i need to do a straight hairstyle or a blowout and i want to go in i also use this to rinse out the product when i'm done like when i wanted to go back curly i use a sulfate shampoo this does contain sulfate this is not a sulfate free product i do like this a lot a lot a lot this is like my favorite i got turned on to this by kinky no by kiko beauty yes and this one i got turned on by glam twins i really like this if you want salon at home type of hair redken is a great brand i really do love it let's move on to some products that i use for my curly hair now those gels and everything was for my curly hair but i want to talk about one more i have not done a full review on this yet but this is a new product from diva curl this is their high shine multi benefit oil y'all i am on I, I'm an oil fanatic when it comes to products. This is one of those products that it like sprays. This is like, okay, I got an analogy for y'all. If you saw my Sephora recommendations, which I highly recommend that you try and uh, take a look at it if you have kinky curly hair, if you have straight, if you like 
have curly hair and you like to flat iron your hair if you like heat styling products then definitely go check it out but if you like the bamboo candy oil dry oil mist by Alterna then you're gonna like this and the reason why I say this is that that one has silicones this one is silicone free so if you need a silicone free lightweight oil that's gonna give you some high shine high gloss then you want something like this I love this it's infused with so many great oils and um, comment let me know if you want a full review on this but um, yeah and my May favorite is you know some some you might want to hit subscribe right now now because you're gonna see something coming okay but I really do like this oil as well let's go into a few skincare products I have been loving skin care and I, these are the ones I, I actually brought it from my room these are the ones that I have been loving okay so this is a brand I'm coming with a full review there's so many y'all like the months go by so fast but I want to know what you guys I can talk about it being a favorite but if you want in depth definitely I know sometimes I backtrack and have to go backwards but this is from a Canadian brand called Shaf I think Shafe Shaf y'all this is one of the best skincare systems I have tried in a long long time okay in a long time so I have all of it yes this brand sent it to me but y'all I've been taking it through a rigorous type of this is just so bomb this is clean makeup by the way and it's good like I know I like the I, I really like this the L'Occitane skincare system I love this this is like holy grail status that's how much I love this so it you get the purifying scrub that is a bomb okay the I, the night cream so good the moisturizer this is almost gone that's super good I love the packaging because it's just so nice the radiance firming serum this is almost gone and the facial cleanser these have hyaluronic acid vitamin C it has peptides it has um, niacinamide ni did I say it right no I didn't I'm sorry I'm just too excited it has bamboo beads it has lava powder but it's great and I feel like this is ideal for pretty much all skin types to me I have normal to dry skin but this gives me such a great radiance if you want radiant skin that is the skincare system to go to if you have my I have normal to I don't really have sensitive skin so that's why I can try skincare products but I really do like that one this is the Murad multivitamin infusion oil y'all I use this in conjunction with my eye cream just to let you know I go from thin to thick when it time when it when it, it comes to my routine so I will go in after cleansing my face and toning it I will go in straight into an oil the oil pushes everything further into the skin and so this y'all with this night cream and then the swarming oh my goodness my skin looks so hydrated and if you have puffy eyes you definitely want to take like an oil just like a natural oil something that's not gonna like irritate your eyes or anything don't put it too close anyway but you put it on and then put your eye cream I'm telling you it's gonna make a difference I'm just saying Thank me later. this is the Lancome by facial face I talked about this in my Sephora recommendations this leaves my skin so soft this is the new this is the Masai water I want to use from now on. This is so good. I think it's 50% lipids, 50% water. I believe that that's the, um, I went to a Lancome uh, training and that's the ratio I think they gave me on that. I could be wrong. It might be the, uh, the, the other one. The, not the bifacial, the, the bifacial for eyes. Like the I'm, eye makeup remover, that's what I'm trying to say. I can't remember. One is 30% and 70 and then the other one is 50-50. I can't remember, but this has lipids and water. You can use this all over the face. I love it and I use that to cleanse my face in the morning and it leaves it so soft with the lipids in here. Oh, one more moisturizer. This one is from the Ipsy Glam Bag. This is from the brand called Field. This is their balanced moisturizing, balancing cream. Love it. Love it because I can use it on my face and body. This is one of the few products that I have received from a brand that I can use on my face and my body. Okay? And it's really good. I do not recommend this for oily skin. If you have extremely dry skin, this is for you. Okay? And you get six ounces. Who gets six ounces worth of products 
from a, in a moisturizer. I don't know who, but that is so good. I wish they would have given us that in the fall and winter because I feel like that would have been perfect during that time. But anywho, if you got really dry skin, that's for you. This is the other one from Ipsy. This is the Love Craft Beauty. This is their bronzing bronzing palette. I love this. Okay, I feel like that this is the Hula the Hula Light and um all three i think there's four hulas now but this is hula light hula and caramel all together like i i like this sorry guys so if the lighting has changed i totally apologize trying to get through this my battery ran out so i had to recharge okay so i only have a few more products let's talk about them really quick so i love the bronzer and shout out to the palette the laura sanchez palette I love that I had second thoughts about it so I did judge the book before I read the cover when it came to that palette but I absolutely love it it's staying in my collection y'all can tell y'all have been loving that look and I just love the pigmentation I love how it's blendable and I just like those fun colors totally something the only thing I don't like about that palette is the packaging it's really bulky if you want me this if you want to see like me apply that in action you can definitely go to my missy q memoirs video and you can actually see my comments and what i thought about that i do have a full review of the l'oreal fresh wear and the infallible full wear concealer y'all these are favorites of mine i would say that these this is currently my favorite foundation and concealer from the drugstore l'oreal did that they did that this is like to me if pro glow and pro matte had a baby this is the outcome I love it it's long wearing and these are full coverage these work like a high-end product I have been using it non-stop in the month of April love it so much if you want the in-depth review I will put it in the cards or like I said the description down below okay so this is a game changer in terms of my makeup if you are oily girl you're gonna want this if you have problems with your makeup breaking up and you want something that is going to mattify you like for instance right around my nose all I do is take this and it keeps the makeup from breaking but it doesn't disturb the makeup if you want that smoothness I actually should have put this on before I put on that powder but it any fine lines or wrinkles if you want to fill in your pores and you see that it's breaking up this by Bell Cosmetics this is their auto matte now mine looks kind of nasty let me clean it up before I show it to y'all on camera this is the most innovative product I have ever tried in the in my life of makeup okay that's how it looks it still has a little bit of makeup in it but y'all I can take my finger it does come with a sponge and a mirror as you can tell but this is like the king of touch-ups okay this is the bomb so I always get oilier around my nose okay and I don't know how to you know I don't like powdering it because I feel like powder collects right around my nose but this actually mattifies if I have any fine lines or wrinkles you can put it under your makeup it's like a primer that you can use on top or under makeup this is so genius y'all I know nobody talks about this I have not seen people talk about this but they need to this is made by Sebastian. He's a professional makeup artist. And this is his, y'all know his fa my favorite foundation is from them. I did a full review on that, but I had to come in a favorites. I always forget, but this is not only a favorite of April. This is like favorite of all time. Just had to talk about that. Joe Malone, Wood Sage and Sea Salt Cologne. My girl CJ and Kiko Beauty got me on this smells so good it doesn't last as long as I would like but it's so beautiful it's so like a natural clean smelling type of fragrance and these feel I feel like are both unisex this one's by Tokyo Milk this is dead sexy it has deep vanilla exotic exotic wood and white orchid ebony smells so good I don't know I can't get through a favorites without talking about a fail I didn't like everything this pure miracle mist hydrating spray don't like every time I spray this y'all I have to spray it on a sponge because when I spray this on my face two things happen it sprays everywhere my top gets wet all of that y'all we're not in a t-shirt a wet t-shirt contest okay but 
The other thing <coughs> that happens is what happened right now. When I in inhale it, ingest it, it makes me cough like crazy. Um, I like the finish that it gives me. I have just have to hold my breath. See, mist goes everywhere. Woo, it is strong. Comment and let me know if you have tried this and do, do you get the same thing. I don't remember it being this strong. I don't. And the nozzle, y'all. Look what happens. I think I've lost so much product. Y'all see that? I've lost so much product just because of that. Y'all, I just opened this. Not a fan. I'm gonna, I can spray this. I like the finish. Don't get me wrong, I love the finish, but I'm going to spray this on away from my face and onto a sponge. This is a great hydrating spray, but not spraying it directly on the face. Okay, guys, those are my favorites. Joseph was napping. I'm so sorry. We're in a different location. Sorry for the echo. Hope the lighting is good. Thank you so much, guys. I'll see you in the next video.